Today y'all, we're going to be testing LED headlights versus halogen headlights in order to find out which is best for you, giving the key benefits for each type of light. Now using a lux meter to measure the brightness, also the distance of each beam. Here we have our halogen bulb with your typical filament inside. Now here we have the LED headlights. Audu has sent me these LED lights to test and they're as inexpensive as the halogen bulbs. Just go check out the link in the description below. They're offering up two discounts for a total of 35% off. Now, let's take a look at the LED light close up before we install it. It's a plug and play LED light system, so you won't have any trouble installing it. It has a driver and six side LED chip structure with a fan as you can see in the back to keep it cool. These do get kind of hot, but here's the driver. Now this will ensure that it works properly in your vehicle. So it won't be blinking, flashing, or working sporadically. Now a side-by-side -side comparison. Not that old style filament. We can see right here, 6,000 Kelvin for the light color, which is white on the LED, getting close to the blue color. Now for these, not a fraction as much, 3200 Kelvin. So it's going to be more of an orange light on the halogen bulbs. We'll go ahead and install these bulbs. But guys, I just want to mention the fact that these bulbs, 270 hour lifespan for the halogen and 50,000 hours for your LED lights. So that's a lot of difference between the lifespan so you're definitely going to come out better cost wise however you do want to make sure that you don't use any bulbs that is not allowed by your state or government these leds have 10,000 lumens while the halogen have 1345 lumens running at 55 watts for the halogen now the leds they have 50 watts running at. Here we have the LEDs on the left and the halogen on the right. Now we'll show you on a wall so we can see the cutoff pattern of the bulbs. Well it's broken up on the halogen as you can see it's going everywhere really. Now take a look at this one. Let me show you the LEDs now. Perfectly cut off. Absolutely perfect. So yes this is a lot better in my opinion but you may have a different need. Now I'm going to show you a close angle of the halogen bulb. Now a close angle for the LED light. Let's move on to show you the halogen bulbs only. Spread out everywhere and in a strong area. Let's move on to the LEDs. You can see it's a much cleaner light. Much more clear as we go in for a close up and perfectly cut off. The balance has changed it in the darkness so it is hard to tell the difference but as you can see it was much stronger in the left light where the LED light was. Here we'll run out the tape measure and we have seven lux for the brightness of the LEDs. Let's check out the measurement on the distance for the light beam. Now we'll stop it at three lux. Once we reach the three lux and we just have then we'll take our measurement. 118 feet. The beam has reached 118. Now we'll go ahead and show you guys what the reading is for the halogen bulbs. 7 appears to be the reading as well for the halogen bulbs. We'll start walking and once the lux has dropped down to 3, we'll check and see how far we made it. This way we'll know how far the beam made it. 101 feet for the halogen bulbs so that's a difference of about 17 feet unbelievable now we'll show you guys these halogen bulbs on the same exact road now for the LED headlights let's check these out and last but not least both of them in a side-by-side -side comparison please guys let us know what you think. I want to know what's best. And is there something that I missed that we could have checked for the benefits on these lights? If so, 
make sure you include that in the comment below. As always guys, I want to thank you for watching Nate's Interactive Auto.